myself as often as you do, Ethan. <laughs> just slipping in, Sonny, why not? It's been 25 minutes. What were you slipping into a camera? <laughs> you're digging yourself up for 11 o'clock. Don't worry. You won't catch it. Yeah, well, he has before. So I can see. <laughs> <laughs> Danny's dressing down. Well, I thought you put it out. No, 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 it's uh... on the back of the door. You can use mine if you want, but please don't. You won't mind. Yes, but I do. I thought they'd like to share. So this table's got for half past. Yes, it is, but I just... There's only place to now. You won't catch us. All right? I'll shoot up to anyway. I mean, it's 11 o'clock. Filthy is. I stood a bit of math last week. I thanked him for the offer, but I uh, gracefully declined. It's a lot of glucose in Europe. I'm diabetic. <laughs> <laughs> the meeting him in the gay bar by the square. Think by dykes? Nah. <laughs> Not to bars anymore. Bit more grinder. The phone app I gave them wanted to hook up with a fuck. I tell you what, bars are now just like every other shop. Order online and your delivery will be sent straight to your door. I wish. <laughs> I speak to me in the in the precinct. Use grinder. Oh no. Danny does. Ate me in the box, you know. Stray greyhound always follows in and sticks his muzzle in the cubicle door and starts panting like this. <laughs> 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 I tell you, it puts me right off. <laughs> sure, I said you'd come back. I bet that you don't even know his name, do you? Or contract, Christian. Or contract. It's called Cockraver 342. <laughs> <laughs> if you call your son that, he's bound to be gay, isn't he? <laughs> <laughs> That's it. He's got really little feet though. Surprise really, because I've always been told that the size of your shoe is supposed to be the same size as your tackle. That is a rumour started by clowns. You should probably be going if you're meeting him in I'll see you again soon. No, we can't, right? That no. Yes. No. No. And I have got two gentlemen of Rhoda on my ears. It's going to be for three months. There you are. But Joseph's on the essays. They smoked. Oh, uh, they're Danny's. He always starts again when he's in rehearsals. He's Giovanni, and tis pity she's a whore. <laughs> Who's he having supper with anyway? It's Asian, but look, let's not talk about Danny. It's not important. He's still got literary agent. Apparently. <laughs> Listen, let her eat the stuff. It's good. What happened? <coughs> Why'd you pack it in? Uh, nothing. That was the problem. 67 publishers all agreed with Danny, said that I had nothing new to say, that my work consisted of echoes. Apparently what I thought of as private wasn't necessarily personal. It's a refreshing thought for a reader. Yeah, well, it's a depressing thought for a writer. That's why I teach. Although I'm working on an article when I'm not marking. Nice. Year 11 boy thinks that pathetic fallacy refers to pitiful penises. So you're a good teacher. Been lending me books for the past three months. Interview for that. First man in that cafe I was working with at the time. Thought my future was as bright as Hellman Holiday reps. Three years out of education to look after her. So I've never had grinder. No time for prop relationships. Thanks to you. Three weeks' time, I'm going to be a mature student. I'm not sure I'm ready to be either. Mm, just be glad you're leaving this town. The only people who ever had a nice time here were the Luftwaffe. Still, Danny doesn't seem to mind. Always off touring. That's why he and I have this arrangement. We never just like jack it all in and then travel with him. Oh, God, no. He lives his dreams. I pay the rent. Still, I like the space. Uh, how is she, anyway? Your mother? No. They won't let us sit with your residents now. And after the, uh, Incident with the matches. Spends all day in a bed with a best friend, Jack Daniels. <laughs> Venus mugs it in for her. Just sold a bungalow. She doesn't know. Been using money to a two bedroom place in Warwick. You're not living in halls? Never been a good mixer. Thanks to me, mother. You seldom hear people call their mother mother. Call her mother, because I guess she's never been a mum, I suppose. My father was exactly the same. Always with other women. You know, growing up, I used to miss him. Until I learned to find straight, of course. 
So yes, go now. Prostate. Just me and the vicar. No dummy. Oh no. Tour in. John Godber's happy family. Should stop writing again. You should get dressed. Come on, it's getting on. Can I have a coffee? Maybe, please. Why well, can't a bit of music? A bit of music and coffee. Black, please. Better off if you got it. Get dressed. <laughs> <laughs> Is that new shampoo I like? Well, I'll let will be waiting, all right? Oh, let him piss in his own mouth. <laughs> well, how long have you got? Ten minutes. It's um, cover to cover, some second rain rag, but still, life is ladders, eh? Pity you're always climbing down. <laughs> so the reviews of your play in the latest I issue. thought you stopped wasting your time, Yes, boys. well, I was encouraged to start wasting it again. Oh, who by? By whom? Someone has a bit more faith in me than you did. See you in a minute. You'd be fucking your sister tonight. Oh no, not tonight. No. The understudy's fucking her. Well, he's fucking our understudy. <coughs> no. Mine's as wooden as, uh, well, wooden as this. Is that your metaphor or George's? It's very good. Why? Oh yeah. Why stop now? You've done nothing but all evening. There's, uh, seven empty bottles by the bin, Christian. Still smoking 30 a day, Daniel. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> you know, they say alcoholism's a disease. Well, if it is, I prefer it to lung cancer. Cheers. Is this going to go on for? It has been that quiet these past two weeks. I feel like I've been living with Marcel Marceau. Danny. No, Daniel, please, if there's something no, that we agreed Daniel. that we'd never kiss them. All right, that's the bottom line. Kiss them. We weren't kissing. Then what are you doing? Fucking jujitsu. We've <laughs> <laughs> been together four years now, okay? We've made our own rules. Me, Tori, and you here, we were fine with an open relationship. I asked you to stop. Seeing him. Agent postponed stuff and I'm working only two weeks ago and you've been seeing him for a while. Come on, you've been with the same man more than once. Yes. They two are in open relationships. Right? They're not single, it's just sex. At the end of the day, we're going for free. But I do not months. want to have this same argument time and time. We agreed, again, right? okay, that this, that this would only work if, if love and sex didn't start becoming. Well, it didn't become what, huh? Bedfellows? Danny, I'm not in love. Uh, what does that even mean? Oh, he feels the same, does he? You know, no feelings for you. Of course you. I can't speak on behalf of him. Uh, bloody hell, I only see him so often because I never get the chance to see you. That is why we have this arrangement. Well, because I'm away. an open relationship, hmm? Danny, there is no relationship to be open in. Bloody hell, last couple of years, double blazing salesman has spent longer in this man than you. Yeah. the nature of my work when we first got no, together. Ethan is more of a friend. He's more of a pupil of than anything fuss. else, right? <laughs> Tell you what, I wish I had teachers like you when I was a... He is 22 years old. Right, he doesn't want a teacher. He doesn't need a teacher. He wants a lover. Yes, and so do I. But look, Ethan's more like you. He's like his mother. He's, he's like, like me. He's like you. He's always meeting men for casual sex. Well, he's like us, isn't no, he? No, he's like you. He hasn't time for a proper relationship. Yeah, well, maybe like me. Perhaps now he wants to settle down. Anyway, he told me he's been the last three years just hooking up every man in his stock. The last three. He spent the last three years looking after his mother. Oh, this is what I mean. This emotional attack, this involvement you have in his life. Mind you know about his bloody mother. How'd you know? What? Two weeks. 
weeks ago, you guys, you'd have nothing more to do with it. He texts me to Just text you to past him. Why don't you go about this? But just casual sex. Okay, no book borrowing, no essay marking, no shoulder to snivel on. Shall you're right. This isn't an open relationship. This is an affair. Oh, come on. Don't come on. No, 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 no. What do you think this is? <laughs> Desperate. <laughs> <laughs> What's you you prefer it? What, if Ethan and I have been fucking for three months? No. Yeah, well, Joe, why, why does it somebody? sound alright coming out of your mouth? I agreed to an open relationship because it's what you want. Don't now, you know? Yeah, we both want this. this. A cat like a cock. Grinder. To me, that's bloody unpaid prostitution. I couldn't go out into the street and find some stranger for a quick fuck, oh, could I? Into the 21st century. No, 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 what well, you do is primeval. <laughs> Gay bars or grinder. Backrooms or chatrooms, nothing's changed. You go to browse and hope that your acquisition satisfies, okay? That's what it is. These words coming out of your mouth, alright? You don't want to hear it because you know it's true. You know what you have for that boy. No, this is a friendship! It's not a transaction, but it isn't love. It's not for one minute that I'm saying this. It's just there's an affinity there, all right? Maybe you and I just never from me. No, that's not what I'm saying either. No, I asked you to stop yeah, seeing I, him. I told ago. you, you've yeah, never you keep going back to it. I told you that nothing ever happened. happened in the past fortnight. Emily, I've seen him in the past fortnight. Why do you do this yourself? Have you seen Who him? Who has seen him? Anthony! I have given 110% to try and do this. The and at the end of the day, you just don't throw it. Stop the at the end of the day! Why didn't you stay with me? No, don't you just stop it! Because it's easier than leaving you! Because you help pay the bills! It's convenience, it's coziness, it's the same fucking reason you're staying with me, alright? It's just a familiar face for a time, hope to when you get one of the fucking strangers! Is that what you wanted to hear? Daniel, fundamentally, fundamentally, we are two different people. Christ, I know that opposites are trapped, but me and you, we're not even opposites! We're just different! <laughs> you don't temper, temper in that electric blanket night after night, whatever the fucking weather was like, fuck, we don't sleep in a water bed! All right, we got poached! I'm <laughs> <laughs> as hot as you are, Danny. Oh, my sweaty onkers, Christ, you were sweat. <laughs> on the carpet in that stupid fluff between your stupid toes and it's not that, it's the pubes that don't fucking soap! Oh, and don't bother putting it back in the tray, just leave it on the side of the bathroom! You hate me! Of all the things to collect, there's boxes of the bastard things! Christ, you annoy me! <laughs> At the end of the day, when all fucking said and done, we are two different people, all right? You are nothing like me. You're nothing like him. That's your bottom line. <coughs> anyway, where, where, where are you going? Anyway, I've been in here. No, I mean when? When are you going to be back? She died. <laughs> Better come back up for the funeral. Uh, very <coughs> well, They can't cremate it, can they? Damage to alcohol and her blood has caused more damage than bloody Chernobyl. 721, she had you late. Accident. I told you. She ran up that block more times than soft satellite. Growing up, give me no love or affection. I think that's why I look like I have. Creating intimacy, you know. Not love so much in an attempt to connect. I thought I'd end up transient sex if it's sort of, uh, sort of amalgamate. Stop being transient and just sort of permanently fill that void. It hasn't. It all spokes. Her death is... Uh, things into perspective, you know? Yes, I do. In the last three years, I've handled more meat than Bird and Matthews. 
<laughs> Not anymore. People like me, or people like her. In war, I'm ready to settle down, and I mean it. All I've got to do now is find the right fella. You will. Already have. Uh, what time is your train? You'll come visit. Yeah, in the circumstances, I don't know if that's really good. Still send me books. Oh, you'll have a library this time. It won't be the same, Christian. Have you seen the new article? What's Danny said? He's more interested in newspaper articles, reviews to be precise. Press the kiss Giovanni's as wooden as, uh, as wooden as that. I didn't mean what he said last year. He's got a part of the joint production again next month, so he'll be away again. Christian. Style and for murder. But the director's modernizing it, calling it Tweet Me Deadly. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I told you. A week ago, after the row, he comes to me with this ultimatum. He says it's your relationship of four years or your lover of four months. Uh, I told him that we'd never even been lovers, but I, I don't know what it was. He'd been drinking, and he ended up mentioning marriage, and it was. For fuck's sake. Tell me you didn't. No, he knows what I think about marriage. Christ, they're watching to validate gay marriage. It's like Linda McCarthy watching to become a butcher. <laughs> <laughs> they're watching conformity, not equality, right? That's what this is all about. But superimposing your values onto alternative way of life is not equality. Besides, liberation is what we wanted. If conformity now means equality, then how the fuck can we ever be liberated? Job in that. Word for word. Just think a, a no would suffice. It wasn't a no so much as. Look, he's right, okay? I have agreed to the terms and conditions. It's not a bloody contract. But it is. It is. I told him that marriage is not the answer, but with you leaving, then maybe we could reach some kind of compromise. Sacrifice. Coziness. Convenience. He's told me not to Don't see you again, right? So this is goodbye. But you keep coming back. It's because I've been seeing you for months. We have never been seeing each other. Time and time again. You keep coming back. Because I wanted to help you. Look, it was your ambitions when I was teaching. I, I had to settle for second best. And don't forget, it. you don't want to be here. Two bedroom place in Warwick. Me and him. Him and me. All right. Yeah. I love that man. I just need things to make sense. What? Which bit of him do you love? What? Tell me what do you love about him, because I know what I... <coughs> pulling your neck. The skin around your Adam's up when you talk to me, and pulling your neck, and your lips. Trumpet bears lips. Sexy, pouty. It's a good pouty, not bad pouty. And your hair. Coconut. The smell of man's one of. I love all these things. I do. I do. So what do you love about Danny? What do you want me to say? Hmm? Come with me. What? Nothing keeping you here. Come with me. Nothing keeping me here. Don't be so stupid. Say no. Say no and I'll go. I'll catch that train, but I'm sick. I'm sick of the only two words in my vocabulary being I'm sorry. I'm sorry for the last three years when I've just stagnating instead of... I'm sorry I didn't meet you sooner. I'm sorry I didn't tell you sooner. I'm sorry I never met Betty Davis. I am. <laughs> Loved her. <laughs> Look. I know that since they got on that train, I'll be saying I'm sorry. And I am. Because I know this isn't what you need to hear right now, Christian, but what do you say? I'm sorry. Okay. No, wait, Ethan. No, okay, no, you, you don't understand. We, we can't leave like this. No, 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 we can't leave like this. I'm in my dressing gown. They'd never let me on the train. Yeah. Are you sure about this? No. But promise me one thing, okay? Go on. Never ask me to marry you. Oh, and lose the leather jacket, it's really not you. It's called the James Look, yeah, they meant before the crash. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to do, Maury? I think I've just got an idea for a new novel. Come on, shit now. Cold. Never did you get a heating pick, did you? Tell the road.